In the previous chapter, we understood the functioning of the door-mounted escape system. Now let's understand how the off-wing escape slide works. The door-mounted slide pack cannot be installed on this door, as the wings will prevent the free fall required for slide deployment. As the path followed for evacuation is towards the wing's trailing edge, the escape slide is stowed in a compartment aft of the wing. In an emergency, it's difficult to follow the normal checklist, and the spoilers might be left in the extended position. When the mode select handle of the number 3 door is in the auto position and the door is opened, the flight computer automatically retracts the inboard spoilers. But in an emergency, the chances of multiple system failures are usually higher. If the aircraft suffers hydraulic, electrical, or flight computer system failure, the spoilers will remain extended when the door is opened. On the left wing, if the number 7 spoiler is in the extended position, it obstructs the evacuation path. The extended spoiler can also puncture the evacuation slide during deployment. Therefore, the number 3 door, along with the emergency power assist and slide pack system, has an additional system known as the spoiler auxiliary retract device. The emergency battery pack powers the three systems. The power assist system is similar to the other doors. When the mode select is in auto, and the door handle is rotated, the door is mechanically forced open. Simultaneously, a signal is sent to the retraction device. The device has a squib, propellant, a floating piston, and hydraulic fluid. A hydraulic line connects to the retract side of the number 7 spoiler actuator. The battery power fires the squib. The heat triggers a secondary reaction in the propellant. The gas pressure pushes the piston. This forces the hydraulic fluid to the retract side of the actuator and the spoiler retracts. The final signal is sent to the escape slide inflation cylinder. The inflation cylinder is connected to the latch actuator. When the cylinder squib fires, it ruptures the diaphragm and allows the pressurized gas to reach the latch actuator. The actuator uses the gas pressure to release the slide compartment door lock mechanism. Simultaneously, the actuator pulls on a cable to release the slide cover. Next, the actuator transfers the pressurized gas to the deflated escape slide pack through the aspirators. The aspirator valve opens and uses the ambient air to inflate the escape slide within 6 seconds. The off-wing escape slide system helps the extended version of the 777 meet the certification requirements. Thanks for watching.